United States Navy currently employs two vessels whose primary purpose is to service and replenish the submarines of the U.S. Navy. These are called submarine tenders. The U.S. Navy's two ships of this type are called the USS Emory S. Land and the USS Frank Cable. Submarines are small compared to most ocean-going vessels, and generally do not have the ability to carry large amounts of food, fuel, torpedoes, and other supplies, nor to carry a full array of maintenance equipment and personnel. The tender carries all these, and either meets submarines at sea to replenish them or provides these services while docked at a port near the area where the submarines are operating. In some navies, the tenders were equipped with workshops for maintenance, and as floating dormitories with relief crews. With the increased size and automation of modern submarines, plus in some navies the introduction of nuclear power, tenders are no longer as necessary for fuel as they once were. Emory S. Land USS Emory S. Land is a United States Navy submarine tender and the lead ship of her class. She was named for Admiral Emory S. Land. The ship provides food, electricity, water, consumables, spare parts, medical, dental, dispersing, mail, legal services, ordnance, and any parts or equipment repair that a submarine may require. To accomplish this, the ship has a physical plant similar to that of a small town, including 53 different specialized shops. USS Emory S. Land is manned by an integrated crew of sailors and civilian mariners under the administrative control of Commander Submarine Force, U.S. Pacific Fleet, Pearl Harbor, Hawaii, and operational control of Commander, Submarine Group 7, Yokosuka, Japan. As a forward deployed naval force, Emory S. Land is tasked to provide expeditionary intermediate level maintenance and repairs, as well as provide hotel service and logistics support to deployed guided missile and fast attack submarines deployed in the 5th and 7th Fleet areas of responsibility. Emory S. Land is additionally capable of providing repair and logistics services to deployed surface combatants and ships. Frank Cable USS Frank Cable is the second Emory S. Land class submarine tender built by the Lockheed Shipbuilding and Construction Company of Seattle, Washington for the United States Navy. The ship was christened on 14 January 1978 by Mrs. Rose A. Michaelis, wife of Admiral Frederick H. Michaelis, then Chief of Naval Material. The ship is named for Frank Cable an electrical engineer who had worked as an electrician and trial captain for U.S. Navy submarine USS Holland. USS Frank Cable was designed as a submarine tender for Los Angeles-class submarines. The ship spent 1980 until 1996 as the repair ship for Subron 4 and 18 in Charleston, South Carolina tending Sturgeon and Benjamin Franklin class submarines. Frank Cable began decommissioning in 1996, but then was reactivated and refitted to replace USS Holland in the Western Pacific as Commander 7th Fleet's mobile repair and support platform. Since arriving in Guam, USS Frank Cable has visited many Western Pacific ports to support U.S. military forces. In 1997, the ship was heavily involved with the rescue and recovery efforts following the Korean Air Flight 801 crash on Guam, and also in the recovery and cleanup efforts following Typhoon Paca. From 1980 to 2003, USS Frank Cable garnered many awards as a unit of both the U.S. Atlantic and Pacific fleets, including seven meritorious unit commendations, nine battle efficiency awards and three golden anchor awards. Frank Cable's most recent recognition was a Humanitarian Service Medal for support provided in recovery efforts on Guam following Super Typhoon Pongsona in 2002. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to the channel and check back for our next video.